Okay, what we have here is a 03 Mercury Sable with a 3.0 uh, VIN U engine. And the uh, problem was, oh yeah, a number of problems. First of all, we had a bad uh, cam synchro. It sounded like the belt was squealing, but that's another video. Uh, they really have that, got that fixed, but still notice we had sort of a rough idle. Didn't have any misfire codes or anything, but uh, you could definitely feel an idle. And the idle was worse, the roughness was worse at idle once you got on it and drove a little bit it sort of smoothed out it wasn't didn't totally correct itself uh, fuel trims were good and uh didn't notice any vacuum leaks or anything we smoked it for that didn't see anything the fuel trims were yeah, a little bit off but not too bad so what i did was uh i'm try to shade this uh relative did a relative compression test here with a low amp probe and you can see by what we got on the screen here that uh uh, things aren't looking too good. We got a low cylinder here, and when you get a low cylinder or a weak cylinder, the next cylinder in line will uh, take up extra amperage to keep up the momentum of speed that you picked up when you hit the weak cylinder. So we knew we had a weak cylinder. When we went into the scanner under functional test, we noticed cylinder number two had uh, contribution problems. We're showing about negative 60 fairly consistently at idle. So uh, what I did here, and again we scoped the ignition and everything seemed okay as far as that goes. Uh, so what I did here is, uh, I don't know if you can see this or not, I got, I turned it over to top dead center at least as close as I could tell on number two. I loosened off the rocker arms just to make sure that uh, our valve should be bottomed out, should be seated. And then I got a compression hose threaded into the plug hole. I got the Schrader valve out of the end of the compression hose. And I got that hooked up over here to the super smoker. And we'll turn on the smoke machine here and uh, we'll see what happens. And we'll just wait a little bit here. Let's we'll see what comes out of the intake manifold. We did do a, I did do a regular compression test and it, it pumped up to about 100 PSI. But uh, uh, eventually, she kind of uh, she kind of just flattened out at about a hundred. See here. Oh, if you're gonna turn on your uh, super smoker. You should uh, plug some air into it. Works a little better that way. So we can see we're it's not flowing a full flow. About 68, showing a leak of about 60,000, 68,000, something like that. And here we can see we got the rocker arms backed off, and we can see smoke coming out of the number two intake manifold just like that so we know that uh pretty much guaranteed that the problem with our rough idle here on this old three mercury sable was a uh or is rather a burnt intake valve and you can see it right there smoke coming out again the rocker arms are backed off on the number two cylinder so uh, that pretty much sums it up. We gotta pull the head off here and see what our valve looks like. It's no doubt been burnt away a little bit. And only about 40,000 miles on this car, at least according to the odometer, even though it's an 03. But there you have it. That's uh, that's the problem with our uh, low compression on that cylinder. We'll probably pull both heads off here and get everything checked over as long as we're at it. So. I guess that's about it for our 03 Mercury Sable rough idle. No codes. It didn't set a. wasn't bad enough that it was setting a. Uh, at least we didn't run it long enough for it to set a misfire code, and it wasn't really setting any fuel trim codes either. So, I guess that's about it.